In this next video, I'm going to teach you how to perform the empty can and full can test. And then this is to isolate a impingement of the shoulder. And typically it's from the supraspinatus tendon. And that can get caught within the subacromial space here. So first of all, we are going to ask the patient to externally rotate and abduct to 90 degrees. That's the first part. Horizontally flex to 30 degrees. Now, what I want my patient to imagine is they've got a can of water and I want them to simply slowly turn and empty the can. So that will be known as the empty can test. You might find it doesn't always cause an impingement with your patients. What you might have to do is from that position, I'm going to apply pressure going down and my patient matches the pressure, match my pressure. You might find that that would elicit pain to the shoulder. It's not always in the top. Sometimes the um, impingement refers down into the shoulder region in you and you think it's the deltoid but it's not, it's a referring pattern. Okay, so that would be the empty can test. Now if I turn his arm up from there and hold that pressure and match my hand now, okay, from there, and then that would also be a, another test you can do for the impingement and that would be known as the full can test. And relax. So there we have the empty can and full can test for impingement of the shoulder.